a new type 1 diabetic is diagnosed, is it important to see an ophthalmologist? Well, yes. Uh, even in children, uh, when diabetes is first diagnosed, you want to make sure that the actual eye exam is normal. You want to have a baseline eye exam, first of all, to make sure you know what their visual condition is. Do they need glasses? Do they not need glasses? Are the glasses um, an, um, a result of a high blood sugar, and will it reverse itself over time? But you also want to look at the fundus, the back of the patient's eye, uh, to make sure that it's normal. Because over time, diabetic changes can cause changes in the patient's retina. What kind of changes are we talking about? Well, it's rare for a young child, um, prepubescent, to have um, actual changes in the retina, uh, such as an adult, where they would have neovascular changes and, bl and blood vessels abnormally growing, and to have exudates and bleeding. But uh, even with those patients, we like to check them to make sure we know that their, 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 their background of their eye is normal. Um, some kids with complicated diabetes can actually have um, ischemic changes in their optic nerve uh, or swelling of the optic nerve. These things tend to be you know, fairly rare. But in any case, children with diabetes, once they're diagnosed, should be seen annually, at least annually.